If you have ever experienced a problem like this on Manicam, you're trying to play a pre-recorded video on your Manicam software and it's showing you something like this, okay? I'm going to show you how you can solve this problem. I've gotten this question from like this kind of issue. I've gotten this kind of issue from like six, seven people on this YouTube channel. They've written me on Telegram and told me that they are trying to play a video from a pre-recorded video from their laptop and once they put it, the video is not showing. I'm going to share with you how you can solve this problem. It's quite very easy. The reason why this is happening is because of the video format. Is that the video format or the size of the video? Manicam accepts 16 by 9 and so many other large videos. So if you record in one by one ratio, I don't think it's going to play in Manicam. So I'm going to show you how you can solve this in this video. Let's go down to my system. Let me share with you guys. This is a video on Manicam software. If you double click on it or if you try to play it, you notice that the video is not playing, it's not moving. Okay, so you guys can see it here. The video is playing, but it's not showing, it's not displaying very well on the Manicam software. So, what you need to do is um, just go and open a video editing software, any video editing software at all. Video editing softwares can create in 16 by 9 and also in 9 by 16, which is a normal um phone video the normal when you keep your phone straight and be recording that is um, 9 by 16 but the normal youtube videos is 16 by 9. so this video why it's not playing is because it's not in 16 by 9. it might be in one by one or any kind of format so what you need to do is open um, any video editing software i'm using filmora to do this come to file new and um, i'm going to select 16 by 9 okay widescreen 16 by 9 click on it and click on import once you click on import locate the video where the video is on your system okay i'm going to go to download i have a video like this okay this is the video i am trying to play this is the video let me open it first so that you guys can see i don't think this video is um okay play let's see what is going to play with but just import this video again uh, some more useless for this information is playing with her now, before she see, married this John looks like Volta, um Kelly Preston one by one ratio Charlie like Sheen. instagram Charlie Sheen, was... so what you need to do is bring in this video inside them um, a video editing software in 16 by 9 format okay once you do that drag it down to and say just leave the setting the way it is on the screen okay double click and all you need to do is um, resize the video. Make sure whoever that is in the video fits in very well. Okay, now play it. And again, after playing it, okay, information. you can see now, it's in 16 by John Travolta, nine Kelly video Preston formats. Was engaged to Charlie Sheen. Okay, why is Charlie Sheen, he was So what you need to do is just export this video. Just create the video. Once you create the video, it's going to be in 16 by nine. Let me use maybe money cam video and leave it in 30 um, fps okay now export once you export i'm going to play this video again to you guys you guys will see the difference between the one in our download folder and the one that we've just created if you play this video on vlc double click on it and play it you're going to see this is the one we're trying to um Fix. Now, before okay. she married John yeah, after Travolta, fixing it, I'm Kelly going to play Preston it. It's going to be a full screen Sheen. in this video, so you guys are going Charlie to see that. And um, let's go to Fimora. Okay, I think um, my laptop is connected, maybe. Let's wait for this to finish creating. Once it finishes creating, I will play the video. You guys will see. Okay, okay, it's almost done. I'll play the video so that you guys will see. Okay, mm. now open the folder. We are done creating this video and this is the video play it now it's going it's playing with um i think media player again, uh, and i'm going to play with it also you can see now, it's in 16 by 9 John formats Tra now go back again right click and open with vlc once again, you open with VLC, you can see the video is in 16 by 9. Now, it's no like, she married John Travolta, it's Kelly no longer in one by one Sheen. ratio video format. Charlie so Sheen, this is how you can do that. And if you go back to Manicam, let me remove this. If you go back to Manicam, and um, where's Manicam? Manicam, then let's say import video. Let's go to 
um, media file. Okay, um, let's go to documents and locate the video in Filmora output folder. I think, um, okay, live stream. This is the video we just created. Click on it. Once you click on it, you can see the video is now showing. You can now um, zoom it and zoom out this black section of the video and make it to be full screen. You can use this to um, stream to YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, every other platform. Call it um, Google Meet, Skype, Zoom, and all that. You can stream out this, you know, as it's playing. You know, you can use this to play a pre-recorded video of um, yourself. You can even use it on YouTube, okay, in case if you have a pre-recorded video that you want to live stream, you want to live stream a pre-recorded video, you can use um, Manicam to do that. Uh, your, the video that you've already recorded and done everything, you know, you use it to live stream and people will be, it will be playing live, people will be seeing that you're live, but you're playing a pre-recorded video. So that is how you can solve that kind of problem if you're having like um, a line 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 thing on your Manicam software when you're trying to play a video so guys i just want to share this thing with you guys and um for those of you that are watching my video for the first time my name is asweekend nakinsley and on this channel i give you tips and solutions on how to make money online and other relevant tips that helps in our daily online space but during the weekend i make sure i give you updates on new games and app in the virtual reality space and if you wouldn't want to miss any of my content you know what you do, hit the subscription button and make sure you turn on the notification button so that you'll be the first to know once I upload a new video. Please, you guys should not forget that my online streaming on how to live stream games or live stream any activity that you know how to do is now in my online store. I am going to be uploading it. It's going to be going live today or tomorrow. I've already uploaded it. I just want to make the front cover of it and um, that's it. So guys, you guys should stay blessed and um, remain creative.